Hi guys, um, I'm going to show you today on how to actually put Hurley tape or Hurley grip tape onto a Hurley. Now this is a 28, it's my son's hurl and uh, it's his first. The tape itself is Crane which is one of the Aldi products. Don't know how good it is and um, I've actually never done this before so I'm actually not sure if I'm doing this right but from what I can see it looks like I've got it got it perfect. Now, when you unwrap the tape you'll notice a couple of things okay there's a tapered edge to it and then on the back there is a backing which be careful when lifting because the first one that I did I actually managed to pull the um, the sticky backing away completely myself which is a bit stupid but I suppose I've never done it before I wasn't actually too sure how to do it in the first place now once you got the backing away there it is just pull that down see it's even tearing there which probably shouldn't happen and it keeps on tearing Okay, so the hole. Okay, straight edge. Look at it that way. Uh, probably about a good, say, hands width. Okay, take that, fold that over the hole so it comes down the other side. And because it's angled, it'll allow you to stretch, pull, and loop it all the way around. Okay, <clears throat> so that's what you've done. All right, let's push that down there because the sticky backing's off it now. Keep on going down, stretching as you go. Okay, give it a good old yank. Now what we're going to do is once we actually get to a certain point, I just got some masking tape which is the only colour I have, so I'll actually finish it off. Just keep on going down, all the way to the end of the hole. Take off the backing of the... And there we go. Got a good old stretch there. So when it goes onto the wood, Nice and straight. It sticks lovely. And keep on going. Okay, not too sure how long you're supposed to put the grip on for or how far down the, the hurdy, but I'll get my good old whack. Obviously, I don't want it looking like a hockey stick because obviously it's a girl. And Junior would probably put me down for it. No, I suppose that's probably enough for a child's hurl because after all they're only looking to grip it. Let's see. Maybe a little bit further. So it won't hurt. That should definitely be enough. Don't forget the top bit seems to be the main part, for some strange reason. You know, you really got to stretch it over and get it round there. Okay. And uh, then we'll just cut it off like that. Get some masking tape. Shove it. And we'll take that. Oh, it's sticking itself. That's near perfect. Put that around there. Stretch the tape. And all the way around too. Might not be perfect, but uh, for my first time, it's not bad. Uh, because it's junior. Don't be using it. 
the fact that it's got a grip on, I think you'll be happy enough. Probably shouldn't need to use this much masking tape. Okay. And there we go. One gripped hurl. Well, I hope that's helpful, guys, because uh, I couldn't work out how to do it at first, and then after a couple of tries, I looked at it and off Junior goes. Thanks a lot for watching. Leave feedback and uh, subscribe if you want to. Bye.